Ooh. We got it. What's going on, Dizzy Nation? How we doing today? Damn, that is bright. It's Saturday morning, you just woke up. If you'll notice behind me, there's a cabin. That's because we are out here in Big Bear. Gonna be doing some snowboarding. If you all remember from the channel last year, we went to Utah for my 30th birthday. You know, your boy turns 31 in a couple weeks, but we came a little bit early. It's the last weekend of February, because we want to make sure there was still snow out, of course. But it's about 19 degrees right now, so it's chilly. Despite the sun, it's chilly. Yo, this is like this is like the Food Network angle right here, cooking breakfast. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Leah, can you open the door? One of the best parts about the Airbnb we found is that it was pet friendly. Because one of the things I wanted to do was to make sure we could take the dog with us. Hey, real quick, let's do a tour. Oh, you want to take him on a tour, Leah? Let's go take him on a tour. Okay, so here is our little cabin, our Airbnb. Standard nice little mountain cabin. Oh, what's up, dog? This is the front living room right when you walk in. So you got, you know, stack of DVDs, little TV, you know, our, 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 all our coats right here because, it, again, it's cold. We got Chris and Goose's bedroom that they used last night. They got a bathroom over here. So, like, when we first walked in last night, right, this was our first impression, right? And I was like, you know, this is nice, this is cool. But then you come over here to the stairs, whole other section of the cabin. You wanna go up? <laughs> I swear, this dog has had more fun with the stairs than any, any anyone else in, in, in the cabin. Kitchen area, focus. You got the living room, TV. You got bedrooms and a bathroom that way. Cousin Serena, chopping it up. And then out the front, you probably saw from that shot, there's a little bench here if you want to eat. Way too cold to do that. Here's basically just a little balcony that wraps around the entire spot. It goes all the way, all the way back there to the back and then through that door in the back where you saw me start the vlog. So it's nice. This is my first experience getting a cabin for the weekend. And it's nice. It's relaxing. It's quiet at night. You can see stars. But all that aside, the main reason we're here is to go snowboarding. And that's what we're going to do when we get on the slopes. So I'm going to fill up with breakfast. We're going to get suited and booted. Probably going to leave here in about an hour because we got to get our rentals because none of us snowboard like that, like that. So we still need to rent boots, board, and helmet. We got to get our lift tickets. And then uh, we got lessons at 115. I kind of figured out know what I'm doing since last time. I'm not gonna lie, like I probably would be all right with it, but everyone else in the group definitely wanted to do it. So I'm like, let's let's do it. Maybe I can break some bad habits that I might have picked up just kind of jumping in and snowboarding on my own. So stay tuned. I'm gonna try and film as much as possible because I'm not gonna have either of my cameras with me all day. Everything's gonna be on like iPhones um, for the most part. So we're gonna do the best we can to film, but stay tuned, it'll be a good time. So I'm picking this vlog up way later. We figured out how to get to the resort. We got our rentals. The homie's right here, chilling. Serena's just not, doesn't even have her board on yet. I don't know what she's doing. <laughs> this is about to be an interesting there day. It is. I don't we know did how it. much I'm putting on but you know, we This is about try. to be an interesting okay, day. We'll I don't try. know how much it's I'm pretty busy, busy out here too, capture, but, which know, is hard try. for okay, people like us who are like mad pretty busy out here too, which is hard for People yeah, like I mean, us who are like, like beginners, there's so many people around and we don't know what we're doing, we don't have full control over everything. I'm all right, like I said, I figured it out last year, but it's gonna, I gotta shake off the cobwebs a little bit. I don't know what I'm doing either, so. Here we go, let's try and do
What's up, Disney Nation? Hope you enjoyed that video. Just want to kind of hop on here and talk to you guys directly real quick. We spent the weekend in Big Bear. Basically, we went as like an early birthday trip for me. If you aren't familiar, my birthday is like right towards the beginning of March. So... If you wait until March to go snowboarding, there may or may not be snow still, you know, especially in California. So we decided to book a trip last weekend of February, get out there, hit the slopes. It snowed literally the week leading up to our trip. And then it was just absolutely gorgeous while we were out there. Having gone a second time, because that was only my second time going snowboarding, the first time if, if you were here for a year ago, uh, we took a trip to Park City, Utah. If you haven't checked that vlog out, you should check it out. But I think, I'm ready like to I mean I was already ready but now I'm like really really ready I want to make snowboarding like like a hobby now like I've, I've enjoyed everything about it It's something I always wanted to do and waited until I was 30 years old to do it And now I want to do nothing but that during the winter time So I'm definitely looking at investing into some boots a board some bindings You know all the gear necessary so we don't have to go through the rentals anymore We can just pull up hop on the slopes and, and just get it cracking So if you know anything about snowboarding Disney Nation just leave a comment down below to you know Help a guy out who's just trying to get into it uh, what do I need to know and uh, what do I need to look for all that stuff having said that I definitely want to keep cranking out some more You know off-season different stuff content subscribe to the channel if you're new around here leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it um, This one was a little short just because I, I, I was intending and honestly planning on filming a lot more when we we're out there, you know, hanging out in the cabin all weekend, I really just kind of wanted to just leave the camera down. I, I, I was just enjoying being in the moment, being with the company that I was with. So that's why this one's short, but hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned for the next one. Follow me on all my social medias linked in the description below, and I will see you guys in the next one. And peace.